Phoenix has the highest inflation rate of any major city in the country. Phoenix metro area has seen some of the highest rent increases in the country, shooting up more than 45% since last year. Arizonans are having a harder time keeping roofs over their heads. Evictions spiked in Maricopa County. The homeless crisis has exploded. We've witnessed yelling, fights, stabbings. Uh, drug use. The city of Phoenix is facing a lawsuit over the city's largest homeless encampment known as the zone. It's in downtown Phoenix and has an estimated 1100 people camping on the streets. Almost everyone out here, they, they have some kind of trauma, you know, childhood or, or some kind of trauma in their life, and then they experience so much more out here. Red, one of our guys here, he's got nine fingers now. We watched as the one progressively got worse until he, he had to have it cut off. In prison, you have your heads, second heads, shot collars, shot collars. I happen to be the white head for Cortez Park, the Thunderbird. I care about these idiots half the time. A lot of them form like a tribe out here, and they, um, they're like family to each other. And there's the me that's got her makeup done. If you're hurting emotionally and somebody says, hey, this will stop the pain, I can see why. It was pretty much like extra strength Tylenol times 100. Perk 30s with fentanyl spray on, that seems to be the drug of choice of most of them out here, but mine happens to be crystal. Mine too. You lose your self-esteem when you're homeless. You know, think about when you go and you get a job. How do you feel when you first get a job and you start working? You feel proud of, you're proud of yourself. You can't even get a job. When I went and grabbed my stuff, I walked over Power Road in the US 60. And I'm, I just stopped on the overpass. And I thought about it, just jumping off, just being done. Reach out to your friends, reach out to your family, reach out to the people that love you because no matter what the, that pe person is saying, that person that is hurting you, they still love you. Your family and your friends still love you. Reach out to them and ask for help. I didn't admit it. <laughs> God, I guess God, is trying to test their strength. When you can take, he doesn't give us anything you can't take. You gotta be sick and tired of sick and tired.